You can all. You can always hear these things before they before you actually see them. You didn't see it in the middle of that thing there? No, I did. Yeah, I saw that monster, but that was just me seeing things. That was an actual monster. Because he disappeared. He appeared and disappeared. Like, that's not... Right. They can't phase in and out of reality. They're not that powerful. Which is what made uh, Amnesia so fucking scary. Was the fact that the monster like was could basically bend reality to its will, so it could do whatever it wanted. It could be anywhere at any time. That's nice. Yeah, it's it was effective. The goal was scaring the shit out of you, and it was very good at it. All right, I don't see anything to do in here. That's nothing. Okay, that's really useful. Okay. What are you doing? Sprinting. It's a long hallway. You are correct. Okay. Yeah, they're all locked. Everything's shit's locked. Oh, I put Catherine in. She wants to get on the damn arc so bad anyways. Okay, I'm just making sure I'm safe. That's all. Making sure. You think we'll find one that fits me? I mean, I'm kind of in a suit already. That's been bothering me too. You know how you were transferred from Vancouver? Toronto. From then to now. How could I forget? Okay, so we do it again. You want to send me to the future? No, you idiot. I want to transfer your mind into a new body. What? Look, we already know it can be done. We don't need to make it a big deal. It is a big deal, Kath. It's a huge fucking deal. No, shut There's up. There's gotta be something else that can take us down there. But Dunbat at Theta was the only vessel that could take that pressure, and you saw what happened. Then think of something else. Simon, please. You don't have to switch this instant. Just play along for now. If we find something else, then great. If not... I'm not promising anything. Thank you, Simon. Wah. Have a look around the room. This is where they would keep the power suits, if there are any left. We have a giant fucking baby bottle. I wonder which one we take. Yeah, right. What's this? Yeah, Simon is a massive baby. Pressurization. He's got a lot to say and it's all stupid. Well, I mean, I don't know. I was understanding him with all the questions he was asking her earlier. Like, I don't know. Those are some important questions. And it seems like he's finally am I starting alive? to... I'm thinking, am I alive? Yeah, well, that's dumb. But, I don't know. Well, that... It is... It's dumb, but it's also... Simon, look for a suit in the locker. Shut your fucking face. It's... It's... You know, it's a dumb question, but I also feel like, you know, they're good questions. It just means he's thinking. And it's he's thinking about stuff that he hasn't thought about before. Like, that he hasn't really had a chance to. He's still processing all this, you know? Wow. Oh my god. Nice. I found one of the power suits. There's a dead woman inside. At least I think it's Herb. a woman. It's Herb. Just like the body we found in the annex. She's missing her head. Gross. This could work in our favor, though. Sure is. Look for a terminal nearby. See if you can boot it up. We just found a terminal. Like this? Yeah. <laughs> Guaranteed to withstand temperature spending from fifth, plus 50 to minus 75 Celsius, keeping a steady 40 on the inside. On the shield, the air compression, maintain a normal one atmosphere up to a depth of 5,000 meters. 
There's physical state able to minimize risk of shock, hyperventilation, and even dehydration. That's pretty fucking handy. Easily assembled through rotating neck and wrist rings that lock the gloves and helmet in place. The joints won't seal unless the controller is able to identify where through a set of sensory systems. Not to specific personnel, but as a default, the suit will accept anyone. Controller, that is the onboard computer, monitoring pulse, brain activity, body temperature, and stress through skin conductance. Use the information to provide the wearer with the safest experience. Okay. HPS tracking. Okay, so that means there's one at Tau, there's one in the climber station, and then there's one here. Is that what that means? Yeah, the climber station was that... Yeah. Thing. Who was yeah. in the suit? Oh, yeah, the guy that killed himself that took his helmet off. I think that that's what that is. Oops. Those were pressure suits. Really? Yeah, that's the place we have to go. On the map, you know how it showed a thing going across? Yeah. That's where the climbing station is. Not exactly great A material. Don't write it off just yet. Remember what we found out at Theta. The suit you are wearing is basically just a Cortex chip working a few kinds of structure gel, powered by the on-suit battery pack. And a dead colleague, Imogen Reed. Exactly. If you think about it, we're actually incredibly lucky. We found a suit with an already dead body inside. I guess you're right. What about the wow? What makes you think it'll play along? It's not magic, it's algorithms. A set pattern. The WoW won't be able to deny us, even if it was capable of wanting to. I'm still not crazy about this plan. It feels wrong. Please, Simon. I can't give up on the Ark. I need this to work. So we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a battery pack. That's one hell of a shopping list. Thanks. I'll just hang around here if that's okay. I'll be back. Okay. So can I go through here? Is that fine? about this? Remote control. I don't know what that means. Oh, we can move. Yeah, we can. Do I want to? Was there anything down there that I need to... I think that's where we leave in the suit. Oh, well, no, I mean, is was there anything else down here that you think that I needed to look at or explore? Uh, we didn't go down that hallway or anything. I assume that's where everything is. Okay, let's let's check don't out... Yeah, we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, Thanks, and a power darling. pack to get the yep. suit ready. Uh-huh. We didn't go in here, right? I feel fairly safe right now. Like, there's not going to be any monsters around here. And if there are, fuck it. What? What? You didn't even... What? We're looking for shit, and you didn't look. It would be It would be more apparent than this. It's not going to be stuff like this. It's going to be stuff we have to go on a journey for. It's not going to be anything that's just hiding out in the well, supply closet right next things. door. I'm sure the first one's going to be easy. No, I don't think any of them are going Anyways, to be easy. Anyways, med gel. Wouldn't that be in here in the medical area? Maybe, yeah. This is a good place to look. But, like, don't hold your breath or anything, honestly. It would be it would be obvious. It's not going to be anything that we have to, like, look super close for. Uh, what about when we were trying to find that stupid brain stuff at the very beginning of the game? How obvious is that? Yeah, but that was confined to one room. They're not going to give us a sprawling complex to look over. Okay. And then make it something really... Uh, hard to find. Oh yeah, there were these other doors. Okay, but these are locked. Yeah, can't go into nice. the laboratory. Can't go into wherever that is. That's where we came in from. Was oh. there anything on? Was there anything through there that we didn't look at? I don't know. I'll, I'll, come upstairs and stuff. What? Was that? Okay. Midsection Omicron lockdown override. Stand by for diagnosis. Okay. Finding fault location. Fault located F3 power room system overload. Uh oh. The WoW's getting into it. It's infected. Uh. Oh, it's a code. What? 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 Okay. Okay. Cool. I fixed it. What the lower? Oh, wow, got in there. Upper. 
Okay. So... That's where I'm at right now. That was the deep diving prep room. So that it doesn't look like there was anything in either of these little rooms. Right. Um, so I... Goes outside. Yeah, yeah, so I think I had to come back here and explore some more. Yes. So... I, dude, I don't know. I'm wondering the same thing. I don't... Oh, fuck! <laughs> That's what it is, then. It's just he keeps showing up inside there. Well, and I'm probably like just not seeing it. Okay, so this is a clean room. So we haven't been in here. So you're definitely. Supposed to be red gel? Uh, yeah, this is actually probably a good place to hide the gel. I don't know, it doesn't matter. Honestly, what I'm gonna find in here, all that matters Where is that I explore. For a cortex chip, a power pack, and red gel. We'll know it whenever we see it. We don't even need to remember, to be honest. It'll look like something spiffy, special. Like a dead person with no head. What is it? What am I? What am I grabbing? The door handle. Oh. Okay, and it's jammed. I don't oh, think they wanted to make sure they locked themselves in there. That's so weird. Are they shooting themselves in that? I I don't Maybe know. Maybe they're blowing up those black boxes they were talking about. Maybe. I am also confused as to what's going on with their heads. Oh, See, that's how you know that there's something there you need. It's shining. Test group 1200 method structure gel is connector and surface. Never seen something of that speed. What does that mean? Time? Number of interactions? Mm -hmm. I don't know. Gel and Like Calvary. basically when it hooks up with somebody. Let's pick at it. Control chip malfunction. Well, it can't be easy. Yeah. Oh. Turn around. I didn't think there'd be anything in here. It wouldn't make sense. Bio safety cabinets. Okay, we probably have to go in there to like mess with the chip, maybe. Let's see what this says. Lisa Cameron, the structure gel has been charged and actually keeps going for a while. Even when you're removed from a power source and apply to circuits, it seems to help out connectivity. Okay. Uh, it seems like it's not only connectivity, but even functionality. The gel can make very, or can make simple machinery work and act more efficiently. However, the modifications that the WoW has made to the gel are full of extra information that doesn't necessarily make sense. When applied to something more complicated, it causes the gel to act as a cancer upon the host, eventually ruining it. That's we nice. could use the gel to our advantage, but it needs to be uncalibrated to get rid of the bad code. Get the virus. Oh, God. The WoW is really fucking with us. That's all this is, is we're just infected with the WoW. Oh, like this so screen. we're just going crazier. Yeah. Like how many times we've stuck our hands in those buttholes. Yeah, I, I have been told that what that everything that happens in the game happens no matter what you do. Oh. By our colleague. Uh, Jacob Halperin uh, applied gel to dead mouse. The gel caused the mouse to appear alive. It was put into the same habitat as a living mouse. The reanimated mouse was apathetic while the living one seemed stressed. No shit. After 15 minutes, the reanimated mouse attacked and killed the living mouse. Half an hour later, the reanimated mouse stopped moving. The corpse was solid as the gel had hardened within it. Delightful. We suffer. Okay, thanks, wow. Uh, reanimated another mouse with structure gel. This time it was done with uncalibrated gel as produced by Eames. The results were impressive. The thing appears catatonic, but it's more of a sleepwalker. To avoid the thing hardening as before, electromagnets are used to cause a low electrical current within the animal. This has also provided us with the ability to somewhat control it. This time it's done. Huh. Okay. Chemical analysis. The structure gel remains unchanged on a fundamental level. It's still the same cross-link gel with aligned graphene and a polyunsaturated matrix. That was take the gel. What? <laughs> Jesus. Okay. That with a uh, polyunsaturated matrix that was installed throughout Pathos 2 a few years ago. The problem is not the gel, but its control or the wow. The gel has not taken on any new properties. The wow simply uses it in ways that we would never ha even have dreamed of. Overwhelming evidence concludes all deformed creatures, the fish, the sharks, and even the helpers were manipulated by the WoW via structure gel. They have in some manner been exposed to charged gel and in turn stricken by cancers, growths that affect their whole being. It's difficult to ask why when talking about an AI, but it all started shortly after... Thanks. Uh, shortly after the comet killed the surface, I can't for sure say if it's bad code or a carefully programmed mercy killing, but it looks like it's not going to make things easier for us to survive. Huh. Okay. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> 